Yo, 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 what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Veteran Vlogs, back with another review. And today, you see I'm representing. I got my master's hat on for 2020. I got my shirt on. Hey, man, we can't be there in person. So, hey, we're going to make it do what it do. But, hey, man, I got a special review for you all today. I got a two-in-one, two bottles I received from um, this company I paid for. Uh, kind of expensive. Um, Heard a lot of reviews from uh, Justin Cope. Uh, his name is Justin. Ah, I think it's Justin Copeland, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let me let me make sure. I don't want to. I don't want to. Yeah, Justin Copeland. I did a review on it. Um, I trust his nose. Uh, I love his videos and um, bow tie fragrance guy. Um, EQ. Um, I think, I don't know if EQ did a, uh, a review on it, but you know, I, I trust his nose. I, I trust the reviews or whatever. So, hey man, this right here, this is from the House of Argos Fragrances, Triumph of Bacchus. And when I say this is, I'm gonna show you though. Box it came in. Box is, man, it has great detail on it, man. It's a nice box and box inside of a box this is what came on the inside of it that is man it's just it's, it's it's great man it's like it's great crash crash craftsmanship get that word out but uh yeah they did a good job on these boxes man um show you the inside of it has the the meaning of it y'all can see that and that's the inside like where it sits at or whatever uh it's nice man it's a, it's a nice box and man this this bottle this is one of the best bottles i have seen i mean if you can see that this is a beautiful bottle i mean beautiful beautiful bottle and get your price on it real quick uh you can go to the website and they actually got a coupon code uh, regular price is 245 but with the coupon is they, they they mark it down to 221 so it's not a bad deal it's still a lot of money but um it's not a bad deal and hey man all i can say is that this is like a i'm gonna give you some of the main accords uh vanilla sweet warm spicy woody fruity tobacco amber rum pottery and patchouli and i'm telling you right now i do not like um rum fragrances because i feel like it's i don't like a fragrance that's too boozy and when i first i you know what i got the 100 ml that was a price i just gave for the 100 ml i think that 30 ml is cheaper than that but and like i said i looked at fragrance reviews and they said it was you know pretty good so i was like you know what i'm gonna go ahead and blind buy which i say never do but hey i just figured i would like it so man i got it um this stuff is is this stuff is amazing, man. Like, as far as the notes, and I'm gonna give you the top notes. Rum, green apple, white peach, saffron. Middle notes, tonka bean, patchouli, vetiver, jasmine. Base notes, vanilla, tobacco, amber, sandalwood, and muskin. Man, this stuff is incredible. It's like, first of all, I'm gonna let you all see this sprayer. Look at this sprayer. I'm, I'm, I'm going in, look. Man, that sprayer, that atomizer, it is something serious, man. I'm telling you, it is one of the best. At I know that I have the Sean John 3 AM. That has a beautiful atomizer. This one also, I think this one might be better than that one. Man, you really smell like, it's like, it's like the perfect, perfect blend between fruity and boozy. Like, it's not too... It's not too overwhelming with the rum, <clears throat> the fruity note. It's just they play off each other like hand in hand, man. This stuff, mm, this stuff. I mean, you can really, you can really get that peach coming through. Like that's what I get. And man, this stuff is. You get the peach, the green apple. You get a little spiciness. And I don't know, man. Just. Kind of remind me of cocktails during Christmas. 
I don't know. It had it kind of has a Christmas vibe to it to me, you know. Man, this stuff is is smooth, intoxicating. <clears throat> this stuff is just it's an awesome fragrance, man. Like I said, I do not like rum, heavy rum based fragrances like the Angel Share from Killian. I got a sample of it and I was like, no, nah, I'm not a big fan of this. But this, this is rum blended to perfection. I'm telling you, if you like rum fragrances, if you don't like rum fragrances like myself, give, give this a try, please. I promise you won't be disappointed. I mean, this stuff, I'm getting eight plus hours easy with this on. My wife loves it. <clears throat> I love it. Cause when I first got, I was like, man, I hope I like this stuff. Listen to other reviewers, and when I got it, man, I it's an awesome fragrance. It is an awesome fragrance. Mm, mm, mm. Man, this stuff in the bottle, man. This bottle. I don't know if you could. I'm sick. You see the inside of it. It actually has the name on the inside of it. If you can see it. But man, this is a beautiful bottle. I mean. One of the most beautifulest bottles in my collection. I mean, I just, I, I like the bottle, man. The presentation is A1. And like I said, this is Triumphal Bacchus. Awesome fragrance. And I got another one I got from them called Adonis Awakens. This stuff is, it's a rose fragrance. I mean, it is great presentation, great box that came in. And this box that it came in is uh, red. I mean, it's a beautiful box, as you can see. Nice. A1. It has the story on the inside. Comes in here. And, oh, I didn't even know this, man. They, um, they actually have the notes in here. Uh, I'm going to give you the top notes, bergamot, grapefruit, pink pepper, hard notes, Bulgarian rose, um, sandbox jasmine, vanilla, raspberry, base notes, uh, mysore sandalwood, cashmere wood, and rose absolute. This bottle is beautiful. Also, I think, I think they're hand painted if I'm not mistaken. Man, take a look at that. Take a look at that. Man, this... This bottle, man, is incredible. I mean, it is incredible. Let me look at the back. Of, yeah, they also have, yeah, on the inside of it. I don't know if you can see it, but man, I'm gonna go ahead and, first I'm gonna go ahead and give you the price on the website. <clears throat> Cause this one, this one was uh, a little bit more. Uh, regular price is 275 on the Argos website. And with the coupon, you can get it for $248. That's a pretty penny, but I think it's I think it's worth it, man. I think it's I think it's worth it. It's a it's a different type of rose. Um, I'm gonna give you the main accords: woody, citrus, vanilla, white white floral, musky, balsamic, amber, rose, soft, spicy, floral. Uh, main well, top notes: bergamot, grapefruit, pink pepper. Middle notes, jasmine, um, simbop, vanilla, Bulgarian rose, chestnut, raspberry, and the base notes are cashmere wood, mysore sandalwood, and rose. And man, when I say this is like a, this is like a different type of rose. Um, go ahead and hit you with the sprayer because these atomisms are awesome. The atomizers. Woo! I'm serious, man. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. This is like. Mm, this stuff smells. It's a rose fragrance, but it's not like the typical rose, like the um, portrait of a lady that have oud and all of them. This is like. It's like a candy like. It's like a candy like rose, man. Like. Man, it's like the fruit notes. This is definitely unisex the other one that i sprayed that's definitely unisex i don't know if i said it or not but this is definitely unisex um this stuff is i want to say this would shine more summer spring but 
you know me, I mean, if you pay for it, you can wear a year round. That one, I didn't say it. Uh, the Triumphal Bacchus, year round scent. Um, this one, summer, spring, but if you spend money on something that you want to wear a year round, this can be a year round scent easily. It's just this. Man, this stuff is awesome. It's different um, compared to the other roses that have the oud. And like I said, you got to get your nose on it, man. You got to, I, I get like, <sighs> let it dry down a little bit. That rose is, is different. Now, still, my number one top rose fragrance is uh, Portrait of a Lady by Frederick Mall. That's, that's going to be my top, my top rose fragrance. But this right here, this is like, this is different, man. This is something different. I'm pretty sure. Get a sample of it first, cause a lot of people ain't a fan of rose. A lot of men like, oh, I really can't, you know, I can't, I can't wear rose. I can't pull it off or whatever. Hey, you can wear what you want to wear, man. You know, hey, if you confident, hey, do it. Man, this stuff is, I don't know, man. It's just, it's an awesome fragrance, man. Again, um, longevity, eight plus hours. I can see you wearing this. You could dress this up or dress this down, along with the other one. Um, hey man, just if you're confident and you want to wear this to the store or you want to wear this, I don't know, to gala or to to the masters. Man, I wish I was up there, babe. Or like I said, you want to wear the military ball because you know you used to be a veteran, so. These are here definitely military ball approved. Uh, Masters, golf tournaments approved. Hey, I'm pretty sure you all love it. Yeah, that dry down, it's like a, it's like a candy rose, but not too sweet, man. Just like I said, get your nose on it, man. Quality, bottles, presentation, it's A1. It's A1, so. Hey, man, that's it. I just had quick little two reviews on my bottle that I got, and um, Hey man, y'all let me know if you try them out, you know, leave a couple of comments or whatever. If you like them, if you don't, don't. I mean, it is what it is. Like I said, they are kind of expensive. I would suggest getting a sample. Don't do like I did, just go ahead and blind buy them. But, you know, I figured I'd like them and I did. So, hey, I want to thank you all for watching. Don't forget to hit that like, comment, subscribe. You all stay safe. You all stay blessed. Mr. Veteran Vlogs, out.